Good morning. This week, I'm gonna be doing something a little bit different and please ignore the state of my hair and I, I woke up like this. For some reason, going for the 90s grunge look today. Um, look, I have like hair like a female Eddie Vedder. This is what happens when you go to bed with your hair wet. I just went with the, the look and I decided that, you know, striped sweatshirt, striped thermal shirt, really completes this 90s grunge. I might listen to a little Alice in Chains later. They're a little grittier, you know. Today I would like to work with some gold leaf. Now I've worked with gold leaf before, but it's messy, so I tend not to do it a lot. Um, in fact, I think I've, I haven't worked with it in over a year. So today I would really like to do something with this and create a portrait, but I'm going to use gold leaf to create a background. So the first thing I need to do is sketch out the silhouette. I'm Lydia Broderick and welcome to my channel. So let's get right into it. I'm gonna start sketching. I'll put this on time-lapse so you don't have to listen to me fumble over my words. Mm -hmm. Okay, well the sketching part is done. I basically did the silhouette of where I want the gold leaf to start and I have to have some pretty hard lines so that I know exactly where I'm going to start painting on the adhesive. So we're going to get into that and then I'm going to have to wait like 45 minutes before I can actually start applying gold leaf. I'm going to paint on the adhesive which I don't know if I should even really film that because that's just kind of boring. So I might just skip to the part where I actually am putting the gold leaf on. I think that would be more interesting. And it would be less floor time to film. Me on the floor, listening to Man in the Box. <laughs> hey, so here I am on the floor and I'm going to apply gold leaf now, and this should be, I should put a towel down or something to kneel on because that's, this is gonna get messy. Um, but here goes nothing. Well, that was fun. It really doesn't take that long to put the gold leaf on there. It actually takes longer to brush all of the little gold fragments off of it. But desired effect accomplished. And it's very reflective as you can see. You've got this whole background that is shiny and metallic. And I think that looks really cool. So I have to seal the metal leaf because sealing it prevents it from tarnishing. It's very important that after you apply gold leaf, you do seal it. And I'm gonna be using the Mona Lisa, I think the Speedball um, sealer to do that. This is not real 24 karat gold leaf uh, because that was going to take too long to get here. So I ended up getting the imitation gold leaf, which works just as well. It just doesn't have the 24 karat part of it. When I do gold leaf, I really don't like to have it all the uniform squares, which is why I kind of tear it into pieces and put it on there so there's more randomness to it. I think it ends up looking better than having just all of these gold squares, because that just, to me, I don't know, it, it doesn't look good. So I like there to be flakes, I like there to be texture, and so I tear up the sheets and kind of put them on in a random pattern. So yeah, that's the next thing I'm gonna do. I'm gonna seal this, I'm gonna let it dry, and then I can really get to giving the center where the actual acrylic pour is some more definition.
So, painting completed, um, and I did manage to finish it in one day. Very happy about that, even though it's nighttime now, and I feel a lot grungier than I did this morning. I'm really happy with the way this came out. I think it looks awesome. I love the gold leaf. I love how it shimmers, and I think it looks super cool. Um, let me know what you think. Uh, if you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already subscribed and I love you guys and I will see you next time. So I've applied the heat and... Oh, this is so comfortable. I was just on Epidemic Sound because I love Epidemic Sound. That's where I get all of my music for my videos from. And I was like, oh, you know, I should find something that's kind of like 90s grunge or something to play. And I'm listening to all of these different songs. And I'm like, wow, this is like really dark and depressing. I don't think I really want my artwork to be associated with this kind of music. So I thought maybe a nice polka would be good. I don't know how to polka. No idea. It's all about visualization. This is me polka -ing. Yeah, it's good. It's really good. Things you do when you're waiting for adhesive to dry. Listen to polka music. Getting down to my roots. My Polish roots. I know there's a joke that someone, yeah. Is someone texting me right now?